In this video, we're going to learn how to check if a number is positive, negative, or zero using Python. So the first thing we'll do is prompt the user to enter the number. We'll call the input function, and we'll pass the function the string enter number colon. This will prompt the user with the text enter number colon. The input function is going to return the number entered by the user as a string type value, so as a sequence of characters. But in order to check if that number is negative, positive, or zero, we'll need to compare that number to zero. So we'll convert that string to a float type value. So here we'll have float, like this. And float is going to convert that string to a float type value. In other words, a numeric value that we can compare to zero. We'll store that number into the variable number with number is equal to. Then we can use comparison operators to check if that number is positive, negative, or zero. So for example, if we have here number is less than zero, this is going to be true if the number is negative. We could use an if statement to output something like number is negative if this is true. So we'll have if number is less than zero, colon, and then here we'll have an indentation. This indentation is for a block of code which is going to execute only if this condition here is true. So only if the number is less than zero is this code here going to execute. And what we'll do is call the print function to output the string number is negative. Then what we can have is an else if branch. So we could have here E L I F and then we'll check if the number is positive. So we'll have number greater than zero. So now if this condition is not true, then we'll check if this condition is true. So if the number is greater than zero, then we'll have a call to print here and we'll output number is positive this time. Now, if the number is not positive or negative, the only possibility left is that the number is zero. So we'll have an else branch here. We'll have else colon. And if this condition is not true, and this condition is not true, then we'll run this block of code here. And what we'll do is output number is zero. Then we can save our program and try it out. So first we'll enter in the number five, and we'll get numbers positive. Then we'll run the program again, and this time we'll enter in negative 2.5, and we'll get numbers negative. We'll try it one more time, and this time we'll enter in zero, and we'll get number is zero. So this is how we can check if a number is positive, negative, or zero using Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.